making him here! I'm suing Ryan Blanket. He didn't even say hello to me! Hello, Judge Judy. I'm suing Ryan Blanket for wrecking me. My evidence is this footage here. Clearly, I was so good, I should have won. Maybe don't fill a five-foot gap with six feet of race car. Hey, no sarcasm in my court! I am suing for a Final Four spot. You can't sue him for that. You'd have to sue NASCAR. Oh, hell no. Not another one. Let's get it over with. 600 likes on this video will help me pay for my therapy bills. Here are the settings. <laughs> All I have got to do is complete 50 laps without wrecking. It sounds like such an easy task, but I know it will not be. I came so stinking close to pulling this off the last time we attempted this challenge. I think I was within a few freaking laps of being able to complete the race without having to restart. But then I, I, I don't remember how exactly it happened. Probably some wall pop by one of these damn AIs that took me out and I, I, it was over. They're already, they're crap. What the shit? If I am involved in an accident, but one of those, after the caution flag falls, it still counts. We have to come up with a definition of what's an accident. It's gonna be a case-by-case -case basis. I'm gonna try to be as honest and forthcoming with myself if it's an accident or not. Like there, I just skimmed the wall a little bit and I never really hit anything that hard, so it's not. Now I gotta remind you guys, every time we do these Bristol races, for some reason, after a couple of restarts, even if you haven't hardly even used your tires, your tires will not work, function as well as the guys on new tires. I'm not Tyler Reddick here being able to use old shit and win the race. It's not gonna happen. So pit stops are going to be necessary at some point in this going. Not a wreck, not a wreck. That, that, that's a fucking wreck. That's a restart! <laughs> oh, I, 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 I am so happy. Attempt number two is underway. We wipe away those six laps that I completed. Now I'm gonna start over. I'm gonna rock the brake bias out of this car. And you know, one good thing that we learned in the last attempt at the challenge was that any up to any uh, shit that wasn't a crash. That doesn't count! Adjustments I make to the car, so if I go ahead and I make a pit stop and I make some adjustments to the car, even if I hit the restart button, those adjustments will stay put, and I won't have to make another pit stop to put the same adjustments in the car. That's a handy little feature. Thank you, you technics. One damn good thing they did when making this game, because they sure missed the mark when making Bristol. Completing all the laps, that's honestly only part of the challenge. I need to win the race, too, at some point. The first part of the challenge that we haven't even completed yet is just making it to the end without crashing. Once I can get that under my belt, then we can focus on winning the damn race. I don't think the first time I had it set to times four on tire wear and the fuel use. So that's gonna completely change this ball game. Honestly, might have been a mistake. Setting it to that. I don't know why I did it today. I just felt like going down to hell. Hadn't seen my boy Satan in a while. Thought we would catch up on the vacation I just took. Oh my God, Moobs is a Satanist. Uh, I, uh, I don't know if you noticed this, but I haven't passed anybody and it's been 10 laps. Maybe that's for the better. I can just chill out back here and not get bothered by anybody. Tires are wearing out fast in a hurry and fuel is also burning rather quickly. It will take, holy crap, these tires are bad. At least one pit stop to make it to the end of the show. Hang on to it, don't you dare. I thought he was gonna come back up the track right up into me. It's coming, you know it's coming. If you have followed my channel, if you followed my gameplays of the 2013 Bristol, you know that the AI have got a wreck soon. I did it again to the poor bastard. Here I am, God! I'm going to be here all day. Why is he so loud? God, he's hurting my ears. The record, the record. Oh my God! 
If I was the 21 car, that's not a yellow? I would have had to restart. They are stopped in turn one. Are we gonna get some sort of pile up here? No, they, they got going again. That was, that was different. Well, they're all cactus jacked. Yeah, they're wrecking now again because everything is so coagulated because all those damn people were blocking the track. There they go. Yep, there's there's your goddamn yell. They're wrecking hard, okay? I can't I can't be involved! I am sterile! I am ready for surgery! Cleaning out the gingivitis. Picked up a few positions, a few people did pick. We have not gone in to adjust the setup, which probably is a mistake. I could make this car so much stinking better than it is if I would just put in the proper accoutrements. I need to work on this car, so less likelihood of wrecking. We're gonna pit here on this yellow. It is a long freaking journey down this pit road, but it is one I'm going to have to commit to. We're coming in, we're working on the car. Hopefully other people pit with us, and then we can hang on to a little bit of track position. Lost the track position that I had. Uh, so that, you know, we're basically starting from zero, but have a handling of the car now, watch yourself, 87, that I know I like and I'm going to have for every ensuing attempt at the challenge. God knows there will probably be another one. So on the next attempt, I'll have a setup in the car that I... Like, I would love to pay back the 51 car but I know if I were to attempt that in this next attempt, I'd probably get wrecked as well. <laughs> so I just gotta fucking take it up the ass from the 51 and from anyone else that wants to wreck me because I know if I attempt payback, it'll go wrong. Uh, I got a good handling car, yippity doo, but I gotta do 50 more laps. Well, that was like the furthest we've made it, right? To, uh, what, did we even make it to lap 15? I don't know. I don't really, I'm not paying attention. Until we get like into the high 40s, that is when I start paying attention. Just like my dating life. I don't pay attention until after the midlife crisis. Please don't run me up into the fence. Thank you for giving me room, Block Blister. You guys remember Block Blister? This movie is better. Much better. Amanda Show, I know plenty of you guys are 90s children like me. We're having a hard bare knuckle brawl back here for 41st. You love to see it. And there, aggressive goes around. Don't get involved. That was, I just barely, just avoided that. Watch me, watch me coming in here. They're all wrecking hard, I just bounced off of them. Everyone in this field is Dr. Evil. And they're all trying to fuck me. Everybody, I've gotta do my best to avoid the prosecution. Pretty old, crusty, coagulated tires here. I'm a little bit nervous about this restart and how much they're gonna blow the doors off of me with their fresh rubber like Steve Harvey right up in my mirror right now. Oh shit, weren't they bouncing off of me? We're fine! I bounced off of some things, but I didn't go around. The 99 tried his best again to end me, and I said no. I'm really gonna, I'm gonna have to make a pit stop here soon. If we could get another caution within like a few laps, I think a number of these cars around me, they're gonna look to make some pit stops, and then uh, we'll all pit together. I just gotta survive until then. I'm gonna run around the bottom, not let anyone underneath me or at least try to do that i appear to be pretty loose on these old tires i'm pissing off t-rex something awful but bro you just gotta cope with me right now oh uh, okay that car didn't stick didn't stick and it just went up the track and well lost a couple more positions and now here comes carl jr trying his damnest to wreck me again the longer i can survive without wrecking and how long this green flag run can go is it's for the better that means more people will hit pit road with me i never got turned around i just bounced off a bunch of a thing was that mcdouche that was mcdouche and he was so upset he dragged grandpa martin down to hell with him typical mcdouche crying up a storm, wallowing around in his own puddle of tears, and he can't just take it 
like a goddamn man. You can understand why I hate that cockroach. I call him a cockroach for a very specific reason. No matter how many nuclear blasts there are, he still keeps coming back. About half anybody. the field made a pit stop there, but that still wasn't enough to keep me out of the 40s. Well, we got fresh tires. I mean, <laughs> I avoided all of that. They are trying so hard to end your boy. If I'd be racing as Jamayota, no doubt I'd be wrecking out lap one every attempt. Well, that gained us a little bit. A few spots because a few people decided to make a pit stop there. So we go from 40th to 31st and we're 20 laps deep. We're coming up on halfway. I feel like I'm going through puberty again. My voice is all sorts of. Three wide, three wide, you're in the middle. We're all right. Get out of the way. I got it. Damn it. Oh, there goes a bunch of positions. I'm not wrecked, though. I'm not wrecked. I'm, 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 about, I'm about to be. I've just been hitting the wall a ton, broadsiding the, the walls and a bunch of race cars. I'm in dead last. But that's okay, we're still going forward. This could stay green. <laughs> yeah, right. We could make it to the end of the damn thing, and I think all the AIs would pick. So this could be uh, an attempt where I win, and I go wreck, and I complete the challenge. But that would only be possible if no accidents happen anymore. I gotta end this. I'm telling you, this is all I can take. Somebody, please, put me out of my misery. I can't stand it no more. Redneck Jesus, I can't thank you enough. Probably should have made a pit stop, but I didn't. I think I have a little bit of damage. Got tire wear, but we're past halfway. We've reached a new milestone. This thing is too loose. I... All right, your door. Down low. At your door. Holy... Mary, mother of God, I just saw the light. I'm gonna have to... Stop! Stop! I'm gonna have to pay. There's like a ton of near misses going on right now, and I'm having severe agita, thinking about having to restart this race again. Yeah, we got a, a big old lick of damage there on the right front, so we're gonna make a pit stop here. Everyone can make it to the end if they pit here. I hate this place. I'm just... I'm looking around at all the people. I hate the people that come to this race. I hate the track workers. I hate the walls. I hate the billboards. I hate the concrete, the lights, the tents, the campers, the RVs, the pit road, the pit crew, the drivers, the cars. I just hate all of it. Okay, let's do this. In and out. This isn't sex, Ray. It's a pit stop. I really got to stop doing that because one of these times, they are going to fight back. Oh boy, oh my, oh my god. It got so stupid loose for no reason. I got on the damn binders and it just, it just, it took off. I feel like I might need to up the brake bias. Like, because I got on the brake and it just, the way it squirted around, I need to up the brake bias a little bit to give myself some more control. Get that in real quick before they all start hound dogging me. I do not have any sort of meat in my pockets. They're driving through each other on my outside. I'm waiting for them to do it to me. Oh, you got to be. I didn't get wrecked. The 93 got wrecked. I have yet to be turned around. They were making a goddamn pit stop. How many opportunities have you had to pit under yellow? I have been avoiding wrecks by one nipple length. I don't know how we've made it this far. I do not know how I haven't been spun around yet. Get out of the damn way if you slower traffic to the right, please. Thank you. You see, that's why I wanted to get around him. I knew he was fixing the wreck, and the 51 is taking out another guy. Very interesting situation. We're not really, we haven't put too much time on these tires. Just a rash of yellow. A yellow fever has broken out, and that has gained us so much track position. The handling is still decent. We're coming to 11 to go. But I got the 51 up behind me. Look out. There they go. They're wrecking again. They're wrecking again. They're wrecking the fuck again. We could get another. I didn't, I didn't wreck. He wrecked. There's going to be another cluster that makes a pit stop here. So we'll probably get even more track position. Top 10. We're up to the top 10 with nine laps to go.
go. Why do I feel like this is going to crumble around me? Something's going to happen. Something's going to happen. I have avoided way too much. Danica is in the fucking lead. Look out for that. That was... I'm telling you. I'm, I'm going to... You know what? I know that I'm not going to complete this race without getting wrecked. I am prepared for some bullshit to happen. I'm trying not to do it to myself. If it... I'm not wrecked. I'm not wrecked. I'm still pointed at... I'm still pointed. I'm waiting for it to happen. They're wrecked behind me. I saw it. I saw that shit. I saw it. Thank fuck that cone. Thank God for that wall. I know it's gonna be controversial in the chat, comments, whatever. That I didn't restart right there, but I don't feel like that was a true blue accident. Blue, like my race car. Just wanted to point that out. We are restarting in the top ten again with five laps to go. Oh, oh, I think the tires are gone. I don't even know what buttons do what. It might just be the, the arrows. We can do this. Keep wow, that didn't work! Fuck up! Fuck it! Bitch! The problem is, it's getting so stupid loose on these old tires. I don't believe I did that the first time we attempted the challenge. I can't control the car on the Times 4 tire wear. I have to be pitting so frequently, constantly keeping fresh tires on it, and that's just going to kill my track position forever and always. That's what the comments would have looked like had I not restarted right there. 50 laps at Bristol could be completed in about five minutes. It's not that big of a deal. We can do this. We can make this happen. Don't get, don't involve yourself, Jemai. This ain't your damn war. It's again, what is, what is with this guy? What the hell is Rick thinking? I tell you what Rick is thinking. He's collected a hefty souvenir check. You could slap an 88 on a dildo and people would buy it. I was so... close to completing this shit. We were only a few laps away. And the tires, the tires, man, they let me down. So here we are, attempting it again. I don't know why I'm breaking down something you all clearly saw already with your own eyes. gonna do it for me everybody thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed i love you clearly we're gonna have to attempt this again it's a nice day enjoy the weather